Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. Hey, I said, I'm let me make a video about how I prime my face, honey. How I keep my face where it's supposed to be. Keep my face in its space and not on the floor. See, because um, my skin is on a whole nother level with oiliness. I mean, a whole nother level. I mean, it be like, shine bright like a diamond. Okay, if I do not prime it, okay, it ain't cute. All right, honey, Woo. I'm having flashbacks, y'all. Before the priming gods came down and saved me, picked me up at the miry clay, okay? Cause honey, ain't nothing worse than sitting up there, taking all this time, beating your face, setting it and contouring for the gods and drawing your eyebrows on and making your nose look all cute you know ain't nothing worse than doing all that and then by lunch honey you look like you been in the club like eh, eh, eh. no mm -mm, no so here are two methods that i'm going to show you or i'm going to tell you about um about you know of the way I prime my face so um first of all before I get started let me just let you know honey that this face right here it it's like let me see I put this face on at 8 30 girl and it's like 8 30 this morning girl for work honey and right now it's about five o'clock so, you know, 8 to 5, that's a pretty, you know, pretty normal work day for a lot of people, honey. And let me just tell you, honey, she's still there, honey. She's still holding on, honey. Okay? The beatness, honey. She's still in my life. All right? So, without further ado, let me just tell you about my first method. All right? Now, my first um, one method I use to prime is I use some good old milk of magnesia, y'all. And please don't mind this bottle because it has been up through there. I found this at the dollar store, okay? I bought it on a whim because I had seen so many videos. Well, not so many videos. I went and got my makeup done, honey. And, uh, honey, I was like, because I, I felt the, you know, the primer going on my face, honey, and I was sitting there in, the, in my chair, honey, and I felt my face getting tight. And I was just like, well, not tight in a bad way, but I felt the ma the milk of magnesia drying. And I'm like, oh, yes, honey. Because, um, I mean, to some people, that's an unusual feeling. But to me, when I got oily skin and I started feeling everything, you know, getting all secure on my face, I'm like, yes, honey, she's going to stay on, girl. So, I look, I kind of did like this because I had my eyes closed. <laughs> I had my eyes closed, you know, because I was getting my makeup done. So I took a little peek, honey, and I seen that big man. I was like, girl, yes. So I was like, okay, let me try it. I'm just going to try it. Girl, I am hooked on this stuff. Look, matter of fact, I got me a bottle right here. I ain't even open because, honey, she's getting low. And I can't, uh -uh, I can't get caught out here in these streets. Without my milk of magnesia, honey. I can't do it. Even when it started getting low, y'all. I, I put a little splash of water in this thing and shook it around. You know, like how you when you get to the bottom of that uh that soap bottle, shake it up, put some water in it. Anyway, I use a, a stippling brush, a little cheap little stippling brush. This is an elf small stipple brush. It was a dollar. Um I just used it. You could probably use any brush you want, but I just used it because it was sitting down in my caboodle, you know. So I take that and I put it all over my face, it all over my face after I conceal. That's another thing that I do that a lot of pe other people don't do. I put my brows on and con and wrap my brows and conceal all of my spots, my areas, trouble areas, and then I go back with like a thin, you know, a thin layer of milk of magnesia all over my face. And then after that, I take and fan my face kind of like what's that Beyonce song I forgot but she be like pet your wee baby pet 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 your wee baby oh when she be like a cool off a cool off so I let it dry 
and then I proceed with doing my makeup. Next method for everybody who like, oh my god, I can't believe you doing this up with some big bad bitch all out face, girl. Do you see this girl? Let me share that girl. Oh my god. Okay, so for everybody who's like, um, no to the milk of magnesia, that's all right. I got a method for y'all, okay? So my second method, um, which I'm really liking, and I'm getting about the same results as Mika Magnesia, but it ain't, I'm, I'm just going to be honest. I mean, it's close. It's like 9 out of 10, but Mika Magnesia is at 10. I, I still, I have tried so many different primers, and y'all, I'm telling you, nothing for me, nothing is, nothing is even coming close to this milk of magnesia and i have heard of a whole bunch of different primers and i'm sure and some some really expensive ones um like 40 dollar primer and that's cool and everything if you gotta you like the 40 dollar primer or you want to get you know the expensive primer that you know that really does what it needs to do for you girl you do that girl but over here this is coin conservation land okay coin conservation is a three-step right. method so the first thing i do is i um take this item right here this is elf makeup mist and set and i love this stuff it is so good like i use it at the end of my makeup and i know everybody's like yeah that's what when you get everything on you supposed to spray, spray that on top uh -uh. girl look I spray this first okay before I even put my brows on girl I spray this first okay all over my face mist it and then go back you know do your Beyonce a cooler cooler up uh, a cooler all right so you do that then I go in with this um Maybelline master prime um and it's a primer it says primer base and then it says um, blur and smooth it's the 100 because I think it comes in three different colors um, a green one and a violet one I think the green one does the same thing plus color correction and so does the violet one it's like um, um, I think the green one is if you have redness problems yes it is if the green one is if you have like redness so it helps with color correction and primes there is a violet one for people with yellow undertones and same thing it color corrects help with co helps with color correction and primes and then there's like a orangey peach looking one and i think that one is also for color correction as well and priming so I take, after I um, use the mist and set spray all over my face, I go in with this Maybelline Master Prime. Um, I put about a pea size on my hand and, um, you know, just put some, put a few dots so I can distribute it um, a little bit more even. Because sometimes, you know, when you just start rubbing it in, it'll get, you know, uneven on your face. So I put a few dots scattered all over my face and rub it in. Rub that in. Okay, and then after I get that in, get that rubbed in excuse me i will go in with some setting powder in my case i use um you can you could probably go in with a translucent powder and that will work just fine but i go in with this um ruby kisses hd set and forget now um that i mean there are so many versions of setting powder there's ben nye i think there's sasha buttercup honey all of them i'm sure they are the bum honey but coin conservation over here honey i got mine from a uh, class of beauty honey and mine was i think like five or six dollars and this is i have three colors of this but the particular color that i use to set um to on my third step in my prime my second priming method is to take a light dusting of this and dust it all over you um and this is the method that i use today i use my three step today i went in with my um mist and set makeup mist and set then i went in with the maybelline um primer and then i set my primer with a um setting right. powder those are my two methods so if you like this video girl won't you go ahead and like it go ahead girl and you like it in your heart not like it on the page girl and i appreciate it and thank you so much for everybody who's watching liking subscribing even just 
view my video, honey. Go ahead and share it, girl.